Hey, welcome back. Well, if you were ever a student at the Old Carroll High School or visited campus, they weren't hard to miss those senior murals on the ceiling of the breezeway. Yeah, the artwork allowing seniors to leave their creative mark every year, a tradition that started all the way back in 1973. And now there's a massive effort underway to revitalize that tradition at the new campus, but they need your help. So how can folks get involved? Our Bill Church will join us now live in studio. Hey, Bill. Hey there, Rudy and Leslie. There were five decades of murals at the old campus. Now school staff is attempting to recreate those images at the new school. And they're hoping to find alumni who worked on the originals to come back and leave their mark once again. This is the last mural that we had. Preserved on these pages, every mural. The original 1978. A glimpse at the decades of school pride, each with its own unique style and story. The 1980s had a lot of mosaics. Monique Sherrick giving me a look at the artwork that helps paint a picture of the Mark seniors left over the years on the old Carroll campus. There's a large variety of art pop culture references. This is one from the class of 2018 following Hurricane Harvey. So that graduating class had a lot of weather events. So when it was time to switch campuses, a plan was formed to bring the old to the new. Thea Kane, our journalism teacher and Carol alum, she was really adamant about wanting to capture and preserve the murals as best that she could. School staff planning to recreate the murals, an idea everyone seemed up for. They'll go in on the ceiling, just like they did at the old Carroll High School, but indoors, out of the elements. We'll go all the way down to the arena. School principal Robert Arredondo showing me the fine arts hallway where the panels will go up. Enough space for 150 years. Our students will understand the history and any visitors, any alumni that come through the building will see their graduation year on the ceiling. Students also excited to do their part. My mom did a, a mural a long time ago. It's cool to see everyone's own little thing. Drawing inspiration from where it all began with 1973. Really nice to redo them for the alumni. Um, it'll give them a chance to like relive it, you know. But they won't be able to tackle the project by themselves. They're putting out a call for those alumni who helped create the original works of art to come back and help leave their mark once again. There's over 50 murals to paint, so we are looking for people to come out and if they want to work on the year that they did or if they want to add something new. This as a new class brainstorms how they too will add their legacy. So far we've come up with we want to do something about the eclipse because that was a big thing for a while. And they're also hoping folks who will show up who didn't get a chance to create a mural for their class, specifically former students from 2019 to 2021 who weren't on campus because of COVID. Beginning January 17th, the group will meet every Wednesday, starting with the 1970s, for information on how you can get involved. We'll have that on our website, ktriplitv.com. Back to you.